250 in the haul truck have arrived. We got another little pond project. Actually, it's a pretty good size pond. And uh, it's extremely overgrown. And it's leaking. So we're going to clear all the trees off around it and see if we can figure out, uh, get everything cleaned up and see if we can figure out why the uh, pond keeps leaking down as you can tell from all the rain. Uh, the water is back to where it used to be, but normally we don't get this much rain and it drains down a little bit lower, hence why there's 25, 30 feet tall pine trees growing 30 feet out to the edge of the pond right now. But uh, we got the siphon put in there to start lowering, lowering the level down so that uh, we can work and not be underwater. I'm going to go in here and check it out. So pretty much what I'm going to be doing is clearing off front and back side of the pond dam, all these big trees and everything around it. Um, yeah. Pretty much get it all open. Everything's going to go behind the pond dam right here, pile it up, and burn it. And then I think there's an old overflow pipe in here somewhere, and uh, it's leaking through there. But uh, got that draining down. Flowing out. So that should uh, pull it on down a fair amount. It's going to be a big tree to take down right there. But it's going to be, uh, it's going to look nice getting all that mess cleaned up. So. All right, well, we'll be back whenever it uh, drains down and dries off enough. get this party started got the haul truck in the 250 that's warming up we'll go down here the uh, siphons already got the pond sucked down so we're gonna get in here and start knocking some trees down so the day we came out here and installed the siphon the pond was all the way up to that you see that stick right there we stuck in the ground that's where the level was as you can tell the pond has been down for a long time because I mean they were actually mowing way out there so there's an old pipe out there we think something's going wrong with that but once we get everything cleared we're going to kind of investigate and see if we can figure out why the pond is not staying full and put a new overflow in and hopefully like I say figure out why something's leaking down there but first things first time to clear the pond dam off I'm going to take everything cleared off and pile it up behind the dam and that's where it's going to get burnt oh how I miss clearing with the 250 you just forget something has so much power when you don't use it in a while. I'm going to take this big old gum tree down, but it's one of those that's been out in the sunlight its whole life and has 500 branches going in every direction and about an 8 foot trunk. So uh, it's actually easier, it takes a little bit more time, but to uh, sit here and just go ahead and break all the branches off, that way I can put them into a decent little burn pile.
break off really easy. All you got to do is just kind of pull them off and grab them. Let's see which one's next. Probably this one. Be able to push it back. 
break this stuff up here off the back side of the pond dam. take over and then it becomes a mess that you can't handle by hand and uh, this becomes an eyesore it causes problems for the pond dam it can start leaking and everything some of these trees even though it's a little pine tree it's dragging the whole machine off, off of the pond dam red clay out here really grabs a hold of the
dug up enough roots. I don't think I did. Uh, I don't know. If I can get traction here. There we go. It's coming down now. Timber into the pine trees.
so so far it does oh now it quit I don't think it's gonna do it I got to dig a little dirt off the roots I gotta lighten it up a little bit
and check it off. Is that much lighter it is?
is becoming to be a bit of a booger. I mean, I can get it down. I'm just trying not to let it go down in the pond. And you see the way that it wants to go. Oh, I got it now. We're just going to have to walk her over about six inches at the time. There we go. One or two more times. Gravity is going to take effect. And there's nothing I can do about it. About right now, gravity is in effect. Just swing it to where it needs to go, which is right there. Crunch Amundo. good little video clip
where I can safely cut it. It's got some branches sticking out. I'll make sure I don't ram them through the panel door. Let's probably just go ahead and break those off. Probably fling up and do something that would make me a very ill. Alright, I think I got it now. off and then I'll see if I can get a log or so out of it. Alright, I got this uh, big pine tree here on the end dug around. I'm going to fill in the stump hole right here beside it so that I can drive right there next to it because I'm going to try to drop it directly down the pond dam not in the pond and not hit this standpipe thing on the back. I need a break. There's a branch up there. I need to break off so it doesn't rip a line off. That one right there. Got it. And here we go.
got the entire pond dam cleared off now. Got a pretty good little pile of brush here. And all the trees that were all the way down, those great big ones, are removed and piled up back here. And I'll transfer these down once I start a fire. Probably start that tomorrow, but right now I'm going to go down this edge and start taking all these trees out and getting them piled up where I can load them into the dump truck and bring them down here. So this right here is quite the mess. Somebody started, I guess, clearing. Pushed everything into the pond, which has now become rotten and is very difficult to clean up. Because it all turns into little itty bitty giblets.
Well, I feel like I made pretty good progress today. I've got the entire dam cleared off and about half of that far side over there. That was a lot of material over there and it's all pushed down and broken up. And it's a real pain to clean up, but I'm getting it. It's definitely open now with the pond dam cleared off. And uh, that over there, so I'll come back tomorrow and uh, I should be able to get, uh, I don't know if I'll get all of it, but I should get majority of everything else around here down and uh, start burning. It's starting to open it up now though.